Charlie Robinson will soon have new neighbors. He lives in Veterans Village, a community of tiny homes for veterans in need of transitional housing. Like many of the residents, Charlie moved in after going through tough times. He found himself on the streets in the middle of winter after getting kicked out because of trouble at home. I wound up losing a job because I wouldn't get no sleep, you know, and stuff like that, you know. So I was sleeping in the car where I could, where I could, you know, wherever I could sleep at. The Veterans uh, Community Project provided him with a he roof did, over uh, his head and a like case manager. <laughs> in addition to 26 new houses, VCP broke ground on a new community center that will provide a space for medical and dental exams, a kitchen, and veterinary clinic for their pet. Today's really special because the community center represents really what I call the meat and potatoes of what we do, which is wraparound social services. So transforming people, getting them back on their feet, and getting them into permanent housing. 13 veterans have found permanent housing thanks to the Veterans Community Project. Charlie says he plans to have a place of his own by winter. It's supposed to be real nice. I'll probably get to see it, but then, like I said, hopefully, you know, with all God's blessings, I'll be out of here. In Kansas City, Missouri, Bianca Beltran, KNBC 9 News.